Hi guys, how are you all? So today we'll continue our Flutterverse series and I am Asad Seek from Iconic Design and in this video we'll see the whole sidebar menu options that we have in Flutterverse like screen list, tree view, profile, project media and many more other. So now let's start with the screen list. So first thing is I've added a predefined project so you can see the big list of screens. So on the left hand side the first option is screen list and you can see uh, we have the whole section that shows the different different screens available for you guys you can just click on it and get to there if you have a big list you can also search a specific screen for you you can use it like that way then we have clone option you can simply clone any screen that you want uh, similar to the previous one and just change the name of it and save it and you will get that into your screen list too and there is also an option where you can simply delete the screen that you want and it will just simply remove it from your list now let's get back to our project you can see uh, we have option to change any screen or edit it any way you want so i will just simply change the text to make you understand what i'm saying so i'm just doing it now just undo it and this is what a uh, screen list is now let's move to another option that is tree view so let's move to the tree view and you can simply go and click on tree view from the menu bar and you will get the preview of tree view on the left hand side itself in that we will see every screen column or any hidden layer available in this preview and you can manually select it whichever layer you want and you have edit option for that specific widget on the right hand side and you can just explore it on your way now let's move to the another option that is profile so you can simply click on the profile option from the menu bar and it will take you to the whole another page where you can you can simply change your photo from your device it will also show the last login time then we have languages there are many different languages available for you guys and you can see it will change the preview then we have arabic option it will just convert your theme into rtl2 it is uh, language dependable then we have change password option you can simply change the password if you want to it is so easy from here i'm just trying and demo and you can simply click on save then we have personal information about you that you can edit it however you like and add information whichever you like and you can simply save it then we have social media information uh, which is also you can add it is just a url that you have to add in it it has no big functionality in flutterwiz but it will help you to manage your social media information then we have light mode dark mode option also available in our flutterwiz you can choose whichever favors for you and this was the profile page of flutterwiz then we have tutorial section this section will be filled with our videos when it's done so when you are using this flutterwiz you will get all the tutorials available so then we have widgets information where you will get all the information about the widgets that are used in flutter like if you are a beginner in flutter you can simply see the information about this widgets before starting into flutterwiz and you can also filter them with the alphabet now moving ahead we have faqs where you can find the little information about the problems you face and you can just get the help from there now let's move to the project media it is the last option on the menu bar you can simply click on it and it will take you to this page where we have already uh, imported some of the images you can also remove it from there easily you can just click on delete button and on clicking uploading media you can upload any media from your device into flutterwiz you can see that it is so easy and this was the simple sidebar menu of our flutterwiz so this was the whole sidebar of the flutterwiz and this is what you need to know so now we'll simply end this video and if you have follow our tutorial series you can see how easy flutterwiz is to use so you can simply check it out and it's free for you guys so till then like this video subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon and share it to your friends and family and also don't forget to follow us on our social media accounts and you can also check our blog of flutterwiz if you like to read and get the information from that too so till then hasta luego